It's a story that we hear time and time again as more people are choosing online shopping. Stores struggle with the economy, frankly. We told you a few days ago about Regency's JCPenney, one of 154 JCPenney stores closing. And this morning, On Your Side's Leah Shields tells us why this closing will be so hard for one couple in particular. Good morning. Online shopping just won't do it for Margot and Mark Gupton. They're not looking for the closing sales. What they found inside JCPenney is priceless. The year was 1989. I was a loss prevention officer and she was in sales. And we really weren't supposed to be dating. <laughs> and uh, so, but I guess, you know, just love conquers all they said. They were friends first, as the story goes. Margot says the first time he asked her out, she said no, afraid of breaking the rules. Then he asked again, and it was a done deal. We would go on our breaks at the same time because he'd be in the camera room so he could see when I was leaving. And somehow he always seemed to meet me in the elevator, and we'd sneak a little kiss in there before the doors opened. It was those elevator rides and the secret meetups which turned into 27 years of marriage and three daughters, all of whom know the story of how this JCPenney started it all. Their love story continues, but this chapter is coming to a close. It's sad to see it come to, come to a close. I hope something better comes out of the property. In the next half hour, I'll share their love advice and their farewell message to the JCPenney where they fell in love. In Jacksonville, Leah Shields, First Coast News on your side.